Hello, it's Marco here from Markham 3D. And if you're someone like me who hates doing nodes, this node preview add-on will kind of get you going as well. So it's available on the blend market. There is a link in the description. So let's kind of just go straight into it. I've already installed it because I've already been playing around with it. And instantly you'll see there's a little box up here. So what I can do is I can add in a noise texture. And this is that preview box that appears. So this is what's gonna be kind of driving stuff that we create. So if I go Shift A, let's go into a color ramp and we'll throw that into there. Color into here, color into base. And you can instantly see what we are doing. Let's kind of go forward a little bit. Let's increase the scale to maybe 20. Um, let's bring it back down. Kind of want a bit of a spotted effect. Let's zoom in. Uh, from here, I might just throw that into the roughness as well. So we got a little bit of roughness jazz happening on there. If I remove the base color and we make it black, you can kind of see those blotches there. But it's all kind of what I really wanted to show you is these kind of preview windows. So what I can do as well, let's just go Shift D. We'll duplicate these. I'm going to maybe increase this one. So it's something like that. Let's scale the size to two. So we got like really big blocks. Yeah, let's go something like that. From here, we can go into a mix RGB. Boop. And then we can see that I've got like a little bit of grayness in there. Let's throw the color in here. And what's our result gonna be? So pretty much exactly what we want. So obviously here we can go to the nth degree. Oh, actually, let's do this. I'm gonna press N. Let's go into extreme PBR combo and from here, I'm just gonna go into metal. Let's kind of just add a new material. And here it shows you how previous materials work. Mm, nice. So anyway, that's what I just quickly wanted to show you. If you if you find this handy, there is a link in the description. I do have an affiliate link if you wanna support the channel. Uh, if you haven't already, please make sure you like and subscribe. It really helps me out and keeps you up to date with my content.